to uh, to run for the Greens. Thank you, thank you, and thank you, Vicky. I perhaps repeat myself, but thank you for the work. And of course, we do need to give ourselves time. So I'm happy to postpone t to July, uh, right from day one. You know, this was a sensitive subject, but. Little by little, we're getting down to the essentials, making people's lives in Europe safer. People who have nothing whatsoever to do with uh, terrorism, uh, murder, etc. So yes, let's give ourselves time. I'm pleased, little by little, to see that we're trying to uh, give uh, the text uh, uh, content which is consensual and pragmatic. Now on the categories uh, A7, as I said right from the start, and here I agree with what Evelyn said on behalf of uh, Sergio Coverati, the uh, resemblance uh, of arms, well th that's legally not tight. It's poor. You can't talk about uh, weapons that look like uh, others, uh, but we shouldn't to get rid of the category, we just need to put something into it, that is, have objective criteria. For example, we propose that rifles that can be transformed with perhaps triggers, uh, uh, you know, there are all sorts of details one could suggest, but I'm sure we can find compromises. Now, I won't return to what Evelyn said about in museums, uh, collection museums, we agree. It's important to identify an exemption for m museums, uh, but of course where you have collectors that don't offer the same guarantees, well, no. Um, and then exchange of information on uh, IT exchange platforms, well, we've already addressed this, we are sensitive to this. Medical tests, yes, important. Uh, now, the uh, online, I mean, uh, physical confrontations, you know, we're talking about trade in, in, in arms, or comparisons rather, and the same for uh, payment in cash. You have to have evidence, proof of transactions. So I don't know if we can say much more. Uh, we want an obligation to have insurance for the possession of these weapons. I think that's the very least one can expect, and I suspect you will agree. But once again, thank you and bravo for the work, and I suspect we will reach a compromise on this subject. Grazie.